Hey guys, welcome back to another Joe and Julie fast food review. Today we are we are headed to Arby's and we are trying exclusively for you their brand new bacon brisket beef and cheddar sandwich. Boy, does that sound like a mouthful. It's going to be <laughs> and it's up next. Stay tuned. Okay, guys, we are here. We are parked. We got our brand new brisket bacon beef and cheddar exclusively from Arby's. And this ran us a total of uh, $8, $8 and, change. and change, guys. Doesn't feel too heavy. Feel that. Mm. What do you think? Got to put that in the bag holder. <laughs> the bag holder? All right, let's see what we got here. Big. It looks pretty big. Oops, I just lost a piece of brisket. All right. <laughs> mm, very smoky. Yeah. It is smoke delicious. I'm taking you in for the detailed brisket, bacon, beef, and cheddar close up. All righty, and here it is in all of its fine glory. Brand new from Arby's, guys. The brisket, bacon, beef, and cheddar. And check it out. That bun looks really, really good. I'm going to pop the top. We got some bacon. We got a brisket. We got our roast beef underneath. Oops. If you could see it. All right. Julie and I are going to give this a shot and tell you exactly what we think. As tradition holds, guys, Sweetie Pie gets the first bite, as always. There you go. Why, thank you, honey. You're so kind. <laughs> I'm kind? And thoughtful. I'm kind of what? Kind, kind of thoughtful. Oops, let's try to get this picked up. It is quite a bit to pick up. All well, right. do the best you can. I am. Here we go. Oops. Hold the box. Thank you. Sure. Mm. Wow. That's a wow? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It is pretty big, guys. Look at mm -hmm. that. It is. All right. What do we say? You didn't say it. I didn't. Salud. Some. That was pretty hard. Can dry. That was hard. Mm -hmm. Using onions left and right there on the bun. <laughs> Are you signaling you would like more? I'm real soon. Wow, there's something really sweet on there too. Yeah, I really picked that up. What the hell is that? Brisket? I don't know, here. Oh, because it's, it's the barbecue sauce. Oh, go ahead. Give me a bite for you. No, go ahead, please. please. All right. <laughs> I got a couple of pieces <laughs> of um, dry meat in there, guys. Mm. Um, overall, mm. I think it's decent. Um, the one thing I'm noticing, this barbecue sauce is definitely overpowering the whole thing. It's very sweet. Um, I'm not getting a real cheesy brisket bacon sort of, uh, for me, for me, and I know Julie, you're chewing, but, um, mm -hmm. It's, um, this barbecue sauce is a little bit on the sweet side for me. Now, see, I like it. I think it counters nicely. Do you want to take another bite real quick, or? No, go ahead. Should I make the supreme sacrifice? Yeah. They, they do put a lot of meat on that sandwich. Yeah? Mm-hmm. And a piece of barbecue sauce is sort of the aftertaste, after, you know. 
I don't pick up much on the cheese. You're right on that. Yeah. So I do get the bacon. You know, it's your typical Arby's mm -hmm. roast beef, bacon, brisket. Unfortunately for me, guys, I got a couple of pieces of the bark that was really, really dry. And I, I swear to God, if I didn't feel it and sort of chew it up, you could swallow that and really get hurt. So, you know, I, I think also that the, the roll itself is a little bit on the old side because how it breaking apart. Well, I think that's because there's a lot of meat on it. You think that's because there's yeah. a lot of meat? Yeah. yeah, I mean, it really is. I mean, you have to really, at least for me, I think there's a lot of meat. So on a scale of 1 to 10, the meat is the, the meat is definitely dry. On the outside, yeah, what's hanging out, yeah. Yeah. Well, we got so fast, it might have even been under like the lamp or something, you know? So where the outside ends would get dry. They're very dry. I would say super Cause, dry. Cause the inside I would side, say Sahara dry. Because <laughs> the inside's really nice and moist. And I even have a little on my hoodie for later. <laughs> so, mm. you know, would <laughs> I get this again? Absolutely not. Um, the barbecue sauce is very sweet. Uh, the brisket is very, very dry. Uh, it's too dry for me. I'm giving this a rock solid six. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if I go like that much. I would give it... You can give it whatever you want. I'm just, you know... I'm not... Mm -hmm. With this, what I got here, it's a six. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm sure if I go to an Arby's that um, the brisket is fresh. It's not, you know, dried out now. like, you know, the Sahara Desert. I'm sure I'd be, you know, rocking that out with yeah. an eight. But the way that is, not impressed. Yeah. What do you think? Well, but you could like it. You don't have to, well, you know. No, I'm, going to. I'm giving it like a seven and a half because, <laughs> I mean. You know, it hasn't stopped me from eating it. <laughs> <laughs> when I refuse to eat it, you know it's a zero. <laughs> yeah. I think it's, you know, a sandwich. It's all their typical things. They did it fairly well. And um, so I'm giving it like a seven and a half. They do give you a lot of meat, thank God, for the price. I mean, that was kind of steep. But, uh, mm. At least you get a nice, substantial sandwich. I think it could use more cheese. Oh, yeah. Because that would help counter the sweetness for you, probably. Because you didn't like it really very sweet. It so was a little... It, you know, it was just overpowering. Yeah. So I think that, the cheese would counter that a little bit. I don't really taste the roast beef. I mean, oh, I know do. know it's there. I taste the bacon. I taste the, the brisket. All right, guys. So six... Would I give it a six? Mm -hmm. Six, six and a half, guys. I, I wouldn't, um, based on what I got here, I wouldn't get this again. But if you guys live near an Arby's mm -hmm. and uh, you like all this, go out and give it a shot. Just make sure that uh, it's a little bit on the fresh side. But I don't know how you would do that. Well, just ask them to make it fresh. That definitely can tell on the ends it's dry. So it must be sitting under the heat lamp a little bit. Because what's on the inside is nice and moist, but the outside, this skin out is dry. <laughs> so, 7.5? Mm -hmm. You're giving the audience the green light. Yep, they should go and try it. I mean, it's worth trying. Just if you like brisket, because the brisket is really good. Bacon, the roast beef, you like Arby's, I think it's definitely worth a try. I'm giving it a 6, 6.5. Mm -hmm. I uh, basically yellow light cautionary, you know, <laughs> go out and try it if you want, but um, I'm not uh, endorsing that. All right, guys, that was our review. I hope you enjoyed it. Take care. God bless. So long.